So hello everyone, my name is Svetlana and I am from Belarus and uh, I will share my experience. It's uh, maybe not so high level as uh, was um, introduced uh, previously during the session. So it's more uh, work with uh, ground. I mean I work with students. I not work with teachers but maybe one day will. So some words before. So I work on faculty of radio physics and uh, computer technologies but who cares? So the main word is radio physics. So the, um, uh, the context is that uh, in Belarus I don't know any teachers who, how to say, who work with Wikipedia and share this experience. I have heard only that somebody somewhere was uh, uh, working with teachers on Wikipedia, but um, I have never seen these people. So, and um, I should say also that I don't work with, um, how to say, there is no exact um, course, wiki course or something like this. So I just, it is a, a gorilla method when during um, laboratory works on our faculty, I teach uh, students how to work with Wikipedia. So it's, there is not, a, not a, a special course for that. So, uh, but uh, usually after making laboratory works, students need to make uh, something like um, to write an article but on paper about uh, different topics and um, something like this and give it to teacher and uh, I believe that it, it is not working now. I mean that write an article only when student collect information, write an article on paper and after that uh, he or she gave it to teacher. Sometimes nobody ever read this article on paper because uh, students just download it from Wikipedia or something and teacher have no time to read it very carefully. So that's why I offered uh, not to make such an article, but to make uh, edits to Wikipedia. And uh, so I had uh, 56 students during the year with these um, uh, subjects, I can say. Yes, so the first comes a short wiki lecture. I can... Uh, I should remind you that it's also during the course of laboratories. So students making uh, physics, so they are not working with any Wikipedia or something. So it's just, I'm saying, hey guys, we will stay uh, one hour more to learn some new tools. Yes, something like this. And uh, I made um, something like, uh, emphasize not only how to or edit Wikipedia, how to write articles, how to... Not, I did not work with photos yet, uh, but I also emphasize that Wikipedia is community and you need to communicate somehow. And I tried to bring all the communications uh, on the, to the talk pages, but not to communicate on the Facebook or by mail, something like this to make people, how to say, to get used to talk pages, because uh, it's, it's not uh, very easy, uh, as it seems. So, it's, uh, I, the wiki task after the lecture is very, very simple. Uh, so, I, I wanted uh, students, how to say, to have fun, not only to um, feel pressed that they are need to write something difficult, but to have fun that, oh, okay, I can write just three paragraphs, um, and I need to add links, I need to add references, something like this, and um, it's not so difficult. And a lot of students write more than three paragraphs, because they feel that, oh, three, it's to it's not so much, I can do more, and they wanted to do more. Uh, that was on the first semester, at the second semester I added some, uh, how to say, features. So I tried to make peer review when students, they needed to review themselves. Mm -hmm. Sorry, when you say add three paragraphs, three paragraphs already too much, how do you find with copy, copyright violations just because of, you know, when you ask, like... Them. Well, add three I, I'm not caring about copyright violation. I will talk a little bit uh, uh, after about challenges which I have. I mean that uh, I, I will uh, go back to your point. Uh, exactly. And my next question is about the references, just because I don't know how good is materials in Belarusian language, or do you use English? 
Not good. Usually it's translation. So we are as we are a minority language, we have usually all the materials translated, especially about the science. So if it's about history, yes, it could be a lot of materials, very local materials. But here, usually not local. So it's usually translation. And references is the references from Russian Wikipedia or English or from the books. So the book is as a reference. So uh, go further. So. Uh, as a result, yes, so it's uh, results uh, collected with outreach dashboard, yes, so I was not sure about these kilobytes of edition, that's why I did not put it, and uh, so um, there were uh, 56 students and only six, seven peer reviewers, so not a lot of people understand and feel that oh, it's important, so that's it. But it's this all is an experiment, you should remember it. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yes, uh, and um, some issues that uh, I have with students or something like this. So, students have bad writing skills. That's about the copyright violation. Uh, Belarus is a very pious country. Nobody knows or heard about copyright. So, it's uh, much more information um, I need to talk about if I want to people to uh, make a very very good realist three paragraph. So usually people just copy paste it from book. Sometimes they change it, but it's not easy to work with that also. But we, we can try. So but Belarusian grammar with that because the language is not so popular. Only five percent of uh, all the population of Belarus speaks Belarusian language, imagine, and I make pupils who learn in Russian, so all our education usually is in Russian language, so they need to edit Wikipedia in Belarusian, and for them it's uh, a little bit difficult. Um, bad teamwork and skills, so I mean that uh, people are not, um, it's difficult for them to understand that, hey, they can review their um, their classmate and uh, to make his or her article better. That's it. Uh, or uh, uh, little knowledge about work with references. So it's also um, a problem, an issue that uh, sometimes students didn't have any experience working with references. So if they needed to something like make an article in schools or something just on paper and to find out some information, they never add at the end, yes, on the bottom that they took this information from this or this references. And this is this is a big problem also. So it's some ideas how to overcome the students' issues. I can read this. So Bad writing skills. I never tried it, but I think it can be maybe helpful. So to make something like offline meetup when people will uh, present their results, what they add to Wikipedia. So that's how they can try to make these three paragraphs better or something. So of course, for grammar, it's grammar checkers, um, more collaboration, talk pages. It's it's in process, so it's not easy also. So and so as uh, students need to provide resources to articles, they learn to how to work with them because if they do not provide, their editions are deleted. So that's that's it. That's why they need to do this. Um, community issues. So these issues that I see from the side of uh, Belarusian Wiki community. Uh, no community support to Wiki education. So the first what I heard when I began this process was that why we don't need such an education because students don't know how to write Wikipedia and they will do that in a bad way. We don't need such newcomers. And uh, it was uh, usually a criticizing side and I asked, hey, maybe you will come to my university and make their, I don't know, workshop and tell how to make it better. Uh, little help, help to newcomers. So it's really little. So uh, ex an experienced users, they usually, of course, correct articles or these mm, editions that students have, but uh, they usually not try to talk to the students on the top pages. Uh, but uh, I had a little support when there were 
some guys from our community who began to write on the talk pages like, uh, hey, I can see that you are a student, I have seen that you have um, not so good, um, something like you write is this or uh, organize this reference not in a good way and uh, please make this a little bit another way and it will be better. And th that was from one person of the community. That, that is also a progress, I think. Um, development issues, so this is a question for me, I can say. How to share experience with other educators? I should say that now, as I said, I make it li like a, in a guerrilla style, because nobody knows that I'm doing wiki education in my university. I d prefer not to say about this, just to begin, and if I will have a little success, of course, I can, for example, this year, I don't know, go to the meeting of the department where I work and say, hey, I had a such experience, maybe somebody else from educators are interested to learn more how to work with Wikipedia, but usually we have I don't know, a mental or something problems with different professors teachers, because they see when they feel that something is more progressive and they don't know that, they are trying to say, oh, we don't need this, it's um, not so important. So they don't uh, want to say that, oh, I don't know it, but I want to try, I want to learn. Because they are too, have too high statuses, yes, but I'm just an assistant, so I can do whatever I want, something like this. And not to be cared that somebody said that I'm stupid or something. So how to make it sustainable? So it's also difficult, I mean, the whole process, how to engage more yes, teachers and make it after all sustainable. How to overcome the Belarusian language issue? This is also a question because uh, usually we have only a few schools who uh, have uh, all the subjects in Belarusian language and uh, this is, is the issue because students don't know terms, uh, I mean different words about this or that subject, especially about physics in Belarusian. So it's, it sounds a little bit uh, funny when it's um, in a little bit another language. How to make students more engaged in the wiki community? It's also an issue. I try to uh, to work with that, but it's uh, an issue when, uh, of course, people can add just information, but it's not enough. It uh, will be more important if a student will come back, if he or she began to write on the, I don't know, community village pages that, hey, I have a question, who can help me, or oh, this or that student began will go further. Yes, for now I can say that I had a zero result. I mean that these guys, they made this wiki task, but no one from them came back to continue edition. But uh, this year I will have uh, an interesting experience. I, I will have in future, yes, an interesting experience when pupils who already have experience with this wiki task, they will return back to another laboratory works and they will work with me and I will give them something like the same or more advanced wiki task. So they will need to remember their username and to log in one more time. So maybe if they will have the second interaction, who knows how it will be in future. So and how in this task can be improved uh, connected with the uh, wiki project because as I worked with physics and it's not a lot of new stuff connecting with, I don't know, or optics. Oh, it is, but I, I cannot reach such uh, good laboratories when you find photos where students can make photos and upload it, for example, to commons or how to work with other projects is a question. So yes, contact. So I am so enthusiastic because I am from the community of social geeks. Uh, it's called Falanster uh, in Belarus. And yes, my username. So yes, that's it. Thank so you. yes, Thank if you have uh, any questions, you can ask uh, when you want or now if you have, uh, if you are not so interested in coffee. Yes. <laughs>